Hey, what is up all you zombie dweebs? I'm Star Lord, and today I'm going to be showing you how to do this awesome glitch in Dead Rising 4 where you can actually fly pretty much anywhere around the map. It's insane, it's awesome, and it's very easy to do. But first of all, can I just say, make sure you click on my channel, go and check out my other gaming content, and be sure to look out for more Dead Rising glitches, tips, and guides. Also, I would like to announce that this glitch was found by a group called Exploit Theory. Their link will be in the description, so if you want to thank them personally for finding this awesome glitch, then make sure you go and do that on their channel. Anyway guys, let us get into this guide on how you can actually fly around the map in Dead Rising 4. Okay, so here I am on the main menu of Dead Rising 4. We want to click on Story Mode and go down to Case Select. Now, to make the most efficient way of doing this glitch, we want to make sure that we have already completed case number three, Shit's Getting Science. Once we've actually made sure we've done that, we can then perform this glitch to the maximum capability that we actually can and get the most out of it. So as you can see, I am loading up the actual case file itself, and here I have loaded into the game, and you should recognize this area. It's where you actually versed the exosuit for around the second time, I believe. Now, just behind where you spawn, you will actually see a Hummer Jeep parked up right next to the, all of the army guys. Make sure that you kill them if you want to. We just want to get into the Hummer itself, and we want to reverse it into this part of the map right here. Once we've done that, we want to then take a little left into this little tiny hallway kind of crevice bit right here, just kind of shimmy on through. That's right. And now what we want to try and do is try and get our Hummer as close in there as we can. So I would say that's pretty good right there. And what we're going to do is jump over the Hummer itself. And then this is where the trickiest part comes in, I think, personally. We basically want to jump on the back of the Hummer, and then once you jump up on top of it, you will see your head has actually glitched through the barrier. Now, what we want to do is stand still and tap A a couple of times. Now, after around about five or six times of tapping A, if it doesn't work, just hop back down, try it again. It takes a while to get used to. But as you can see, I have done it on my third try, and now we are technically out of the map. What we want to do is go to this little area right here where it says number one, go inside the actual box, and then we want to go over to the balcony right here. Now once here, what we want to do is jump over this gate right here or this ledge, and we want to aim for the walkway below us. But as you can see, I am floating in midair, and that is because as you are falling, you want to slowly start tapping the A button once you hit that walkway, and you will start to levitate in midair, but you must always keep on tapping A very slowly. Now you just saw me drop down, and that is because I actually performed a double jump, which actually makes you fall down. So if you do mess up the glitch like me, all you have to do is just drop to the very bottom of the map and you will actually spawn right here at the checkpoint once again. And as you can see, my Hummer Jeep is still there and yeah, we can now go and try and perform the glitch again properly and actually do it successfully. Now, at the start of the video, I said that this glitch was very easy to do, and that's because it is. Genuinely, the hardest part about this is the part you're seeing right now, the part where I have to actually jump and barrier break into the room above me. But once you guys get that done, the levitating part is pretty simple to do. I will go through it just one more time and slow the video down just a little bit. Once you get here on this ledge, just jump over it and head for the barrier below you. Once you push forward onto it, just hold forward and tap A very slowly. Eventually, you will see yourself jumping in the same spot and then you will start to levitate around the map. When you're actually levitating, guys, you always have to keep on tapping the A button very, very slowly. Tap it a little bit quicker if you want to ascend and then tap it slower if you want to descend. That zombie just committed suicide. That was... <laughs> The zombie committed suicide. Um, but yeah, guys, do not let this discourage you if you don't get it on the first couple of tries. Anyway, if you did enjoy this video, then please remember to give a like before you leave and consider going to my channel for more gaming videos around the gaming world. Anyway, guys, have an awesome day, and until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.